But the fact that she was, she felt like, what's the word? If it's me coming to my country, that's different. Her coming to, you know, it, like, wait, I don't understand. You're coming She's not to a like foreign you. country. You didn't ask your son to pick you up. You decided to take a cab. The cab driver was so aggressive. You did not put your bag down and wait for the next cab. It was almost like she was so Nigerian. She was comfortable with the situation. Like, that's what like, so we did do. And where could we go? Yeah. <laughs> Everybody say, Jumoke is a loose girl. Jumoke is a loose girl. But Jumoke got the juice. I just can't seem to cut a loose. I no say, Jumoke, you a loose girl. Jumoke, you a loose girl. But Jumoke got the juice. Squeeze fresh from the forbidden fruit. Yeah. Okay, guys, welcome to another video so last time we did a reaction on Na nollywood bollywood mashup namaste wahala if you haven't seen it i'll put a card up below click it and see our reaction and our discussion on the trailer but now the movie dropped on valentine's day sunday we have seen it and it's time to give a full review if you don't know us i am jules and this is my first Jane and you're welcome to tea or pepper soup as it gets hot. Hmm. If you haven't done it, take out the time, click the like button as it goes a long way for this channel. And also do consider subscribing to this channel. That's out of the way, girl. I didn't watch numbers. I did I did watch them when I did social media. I went to social media and I was like, people were putting screenshots of the Yes, TV or something. Anyway, it was just Namaste or Hala screenshots everywhere. And I'm like, a two movie come outside because am I watching <laughs> something different? Because mm, I watched this movie with a lot of people. And Joy was there. In fact, because the whole family was there. And there were so many cringe worthy moments. I was like, hmm. Good mm. Lord. I had mm -hmm. so many high hopes, and my high hopes were just got smashed to the ground like that. There was nothing left. So, before I go into details of different scenes, I mean, it's not everything wasn't bad. I can give some wordy scenes and some actors that tried to uplift their characters. But before we go into it proper, what do you think about mm -hmm. Namaste Wahala? It was a snooze fest. Let's not just lie. The trailer was better than the actual movie. <laughs> I was very, very, very disappointed. I cannot, it was very amateuric. Is that a word? That, it was. If it's not a word, we should contact Oxford. It should be. It was it. Oh no, no, no! I struggled to finish that movie. It was like pause. Okay, we'll come back to it. It just the fact that we're going to talk about it is the main reason I that was able to made watch me it go through it. it. Yes, mm -hmm. that was yeah. the reason that made me go through it. If it was just mm -hmm. a movie I was watching for like strictly pleasure and I didn't have to come back and talk about it, I would have stopped. Mm -hmm. I would not have completed. Mm -hmm. I was stopped. That. Oh my god, Namaste Wahala. They should have just left us with the trailer. We would have been wanting more if it was just the trailer. Because was, the movie terrible. itself, I was like, why? Even the actors, I was kind of very disappointed. But uh, like I said, uh, the main person that, you know, I wasn't disappointed, she came correct, was Ajoke Siva. And I felt and like the female lead did okay for no, the female lead no, did better. It did no, okay. no, if you watch that lady's, if you watch what's her name, Idima, or what's her name, if you watch all her movies, she plays the same character. Plays she's same consistent, character. Mm -hmm, she's consistent with same uh facial expressions, attitude, everything like. I'm bored of her already. She is pretty, but she doesn't bring anything new. Every time they cast her in any movie, is the same. The same, almost like the same. She's always the daughter of, oh, you know, or someone rich. rich man. Uh, yeah, like, oh, daddy. And other than that, 
I feel like she hasn't gotten that challenging role. She might be a great actress, maybe. But maybe she has, because I say this, people don't understand that it's not all about just acting. You need to get that role that, you know, shows you and your that, that, talent. That you shine. Yeah. And she hasn't gotten that role yet. And this movie, oh, when they went to the singing scene. Oh, oh Jesus God. Christ. I need to talk about that too. See, all of us were sitting down, we were enduring the movie, and then, you know the way the singing thing came, it was just like, gish, gish, gish. and then it was like, they won't sing. And I was like, no, they're not singing, it's just like, it's a Bollywood director, the Bollywood director, they won't sing. And then immediately the song started, everybody scattered, like, I wish I had a camera <laughs> yeah. We are eating and everybody went, that way, that way, that way. I was like, <laughs> Mm-mm. 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 It was so cringy. Somebody stay mm-hmm. fast forward in it. <laughs> Who did I be watching this? Every day fast forward to me. I was like, why? My point is that it's not the fact that it's sang. I understood it was a Bollywood director. Of Bollywood, they do have this music break in between their film. But it wasn't even a good music. I'm like, why bother? It wasn't catchy. It wasn't making me, you know, down. Then they were bad, they were bad. They were acting and I knew they were acting. The scene of the girl laughing. Crying. Crying. Crying, laughing. Cry, laughing. (laughs) There were seen so many scenes that were uncomfortable to watch. And that scene was it. I was like, um, girl, are you not supposed to be heartbroken? What's up? What's going on? It wasn't heartbroken to be in a defense. I even felt like she actually she she killed her role better than the lead actress because she wasn't really heartbroken. She was just trying to be dramatic. So it wasn't like a real because like she said, were you even dating someone that she was with for like one week? You understand? Well, she was just like, oh, but I can understand it being a playful scene because coming out <laughs> <laughs> that was an ironic <laughs> yawn. <laughs> it was an ironic yawn. Ah! Let me go and see. Oh my God. What are you were saying? I kind of lost my train of thought. What? <laughs> you said the scene was meant to be funny. Somebody she was dating for just like one week. Oh, and then that's how you lost me. It was. <laughs> hey, stop! <laughs> oh, that is that summarizes the whole movie. It was well, that was what you so green, so and I was very disappointed because I thought that you know the Indian, or maybe those are Indians that have been in Nigeria. Or V. Those Indians were so watered down, I did not know what. But the is. director of the, the series is the. The, what's the girl? director of the series is the Indian. Movie, rather. Of, the, yeah. of the movie is Indian. Yes, I get that. But the Indians in the movie were so Nigerian. <laughs> the, the lead actor, is he. I, I think they brought him. He's not someone that lives in Nigeria because he looks famous, kind of. The lead actor, I don't, girl, I don't, I don't watch Bollywood movie, I don't watch Nollywood movie, and I feel like I should watch both together. In the entire film, I only knew R.M.B., uh, Joker Silva, and Brother Shaggy. Mm. I didn't even know the lead actress. Mm. I know her. Like I said, she's been in. I've watched like several. You told me about uh, Battleground that she was in movie called Battleground. Yeah. In the like, our expressions are the same. Like, I feel like as an actor, if you cannot bring different elements, you know, show different sides of, you know, who you are, oh. I cannot relate to that. And I cannot tame you a good actor. And that's something that I'm stuck on when it comes to her. It's the same acting. Every movie I see her, she's giving me the same thing, which is a problem. Now, coming to the infusion of the Indian and the Nigerian whole thing, Ooh. I thought that, I felt like everybody wasn't comfortable. Even in, even like the Nigerian part of it, 
it wasn't strong like our normal Nigerian movie. Do you understand what I mean? Because they were posh Nigerians. Even if, like, ah, but even if it was posh Nigerian, but there was just something about it. It was just stuck. Uh, there was they just were something. They were stuck up Nigerians as well. They it, were it was stuck and up. And then the Indian part of it, the way they infused the, the whole, it didn't, they didn't read, what's the word? They didn't they did not read the them. culture as much as I thought they would. No, they did not bring, if I they, they, they disappointed, I would say the Indians would be disappointed because Indians was, should be disappointed. I thought when Mama Indian arrived, there was going to be like a law culture. We're going to, like the boy has been in Nigeria working. I didn't expect to get culture from him. I expected like when the mother come, we would get the culture. All they showed me was her fasting on the bed when the girl was sleeping and then saying I'm on the plane. Even at the airport. Let's go, no? I'm not gonna do that when I Well, go let's to talk about Brother Shaggy Sha. It was the comic relief I needed in that movie. Yes. But like like I said, there was just something. Now he was coming at her, though coming too strong. Very I understand. strong, unnecessarily strong. I don't think I've ever met a cab driver that came that strong. But the fact that she was she felt like what's the word if it's me coming to my country that's different her coming to you know it like, wait i don't understand yeah, coming She's not to a like foreign you. country you didn't ask your son to pick you up you decided to take a cab the cab driver was so aggressive you did not put your bag down and wait for the next cab it was almost like she was so Nigerian, she was comfortable with the situation, like, that's what we did do, and where could we go? Yeah, I'm the like, in Indian culture, when it comes to, like, the slums, so to say, it's very similar to yes. the Nigerian people, you understand? So maybe I can understand, maybe, but Doesn't anyway. Doesn't look like a slum mother. No, what I'm saying is... It, it, if not every Nigerian comes from the slum, but when you go to a certain place and someone you answer, hey, hey, you know, you you know what to do because yeah, you that. live in the hair. But what I'm saying is still going to a foreign country, like you ca I cannot let someone talk to me like that. In the hell now. Like she was too comfortable in the Unless it's American like getting shot. I might just let you, you talk to me and drop my bags down. I'm like, oh, that's a good thing. Then when they when they when they tried when Leah or whatever the girl's name was when she tried to convince her that oh, the girl uh she's a good person Didi is good the with from the hatred when she switched from hatred to love it was so weak it was like oh just came in just started touching girls okay uh, okay because oh, I think I, I think it wasn't actually hatred uh a dislike of the girl had nothing to oh, no, do no no not be hatred is a strong word yeah i don't think yeah. she disliked the girl i don't even think she disliked the girl for her race i don't think she disliked the girl for uh, I, the boy was a mama's boy and i think it was just a mama's boy being territorial you know see and see when she come there say oh you have a girlfriend ah she's nigerian or whatever then she not said i have a punjabi girl for you she never said anything like she was going to bring an indian girl so i don't think our own dislike of the girl has anything to do with the girl just the dislike of a woman coming into my son's life that kind of dislike. i think it's because she's nigerian as well because it's the same thing she didn't want it she wanted her son to marry from their culture so does the the girls people Parents, want they wanted the same culture kind of thing um, i get yes. but i don't think the way she switched you can't be so hyped on that culture and switch that fast. Not so much like you understand what I'm like. You just walked in, you just saw her touching girls, and then okay, she cannot come and marry my son because she's compassionate. Do you understand what I mean? Like it could be something like, okay, I felt like the switch could have been she really makes my son happy. Now I see that when like you understand, like when they broke up, because that the time she she changed, they broke up. So it should have been something like since they broke up the boy as been sad, he wouldn't he wouldn't talk to her. You understand what I mean? And then she decided to cave in. But the fact that they were they were not together at the time, and then they just say, come and see, she's a nice person. You just went and saw her talking to the girls, and you're like, hmm. We really paid attention me. to this movie we do not like her. I, I just felt like she put it out there. there. Like and you know I'm going to come. My point is me. that my point is that the movie had like see us discussing this now. The movie had a good set of skeleton to work with 
but they missed the target. Then the other one she was fighting with her father about the abuse case. That was such a mess. I was like, no, that makes sense because it was it that was a We already know that she was a lawyer that was working pro bono for um, violence against women and all that. We already got but the was she working for her father. So she's she working wasn't working bono. for her father. She was working pro bono. And her father... No. She's working for the, the first thing. The father was like, I don't know why you won't come and work with me when she wanted him to marry, when he wanted her to work with, what's this? She nom so nom so. Somebody nom so. Some told, some told, some told, some told uh, hey. Uh, no, no. So he, 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 she no, should he, leave he that nonsense and come and work in his company. Ah, no, no he God. works for the, no. Look, she works for the company, but she's handling pro bono cases. That's why the Somto said, it makes the company look good. You see that at, at some point she said, I quit because she actually still works for the company, but she wants to focus on pro bono. Uh, Do you understand? Uh, so I'm really was, to that movie, I yeah, she, but she said, I quit. Okay. The father just wanted her to not be doing pro bono and do me, you know, you know how it is. Oh, yeah, let's talk about this wedding scene. This wedding scene that made um, my heart bleed. I was going through the movie. Let me just tell you, the entire movie, and I was like, this movie is not thinking any bell in me. I'm just going through the motions till the wedding comes. Let me get excited, at least, at the wedding. Yes. That was the weakest wedding ever. Let me tell you, let me tell you what saved them. Even for a Nigerian yeah. wedding, that is weak. Let me tell you what saved them. They did not put emphasis on the wedding. Because you know what we we're talking yes, about? Yes, they did not put any emphasis on it. Like, but still, I was still waiting to see... They mm. tried though. They brought all the not try and bag. Did you see the girl she dressed the in, in sari and he dressed again and everybody sat down? They came with their tiny hole and flowers. Again, this is my problem again. The wardrobe when it comes to Nigerian movies are the worst. My problem is that wardrobe, it almost feels like everyone has to come with their clothes from home. It's only when you want to act like a madman, mad woman or these epic movies, that's when they come with costumes that are just all in a bag. Okay, so let the one that's your size tie. Do you understand? Like, you're going into a movie, you have to actually get someone, not costume, wardrobe. Every bag, every shoe, hair, makeup, has to be with your vision. Has to... How can you be... How can you tell me you want to go to the... You cannot even get one beautiful Indian set. Oh, gosh. Even the guy, even the mother, she could not come with the fashion. Do you understand? I see, that's why you see these Indian movies. I've seen some of it. Even the poor people, you see their... You, you understand what I mean? Like, whatever there it is... There is no point. Oh, my gosh. How can you do that? Then that dancing, the singing, or whatever, it was very irrelevant to the movie. If they were going to bring it... They, they should have, have gone, gone all out. You could have done good choreography. Good choreography, very good catchy song. Let's get everybody dancing and doing the thing. Let's know that, okay, we went there. We actually went there. It was like, why? Why? Why put they my eyes my brain through this? I could not scrub it off. They could have gotten back up. You don't see Indian movies. Back up dancers are like one million. <laughs> You just be walking on the street and all of a sudden in the market people they know Everybody the choreography. Dancing. Everybody's in on the dancing. I'm like, okay. You can't even you can't even do a turn and then land properly with it. Like, oh, there was okay. nothing. Let me say something in their defense. Yeah. In their defense of they couldn't go out to the that all out to the, unlike all that um I don't know what to call them, studios. Nollywood does not have an actual studio. Hollywood, Bollywood, those people have a studio, meaning a place that is specifically for them acting and doing that without outside interruption. We, we don't have that. We only go to locations. There is no actual studio in Nigeria. So for Bollywood, you, they can, when they do those, they are big dancing that everybody crowd is involved. Those things are done in studio. They don't actually come and take up a space. But you know, that's that. not our problem. You know, that's that a, my problem is that when you're talking about the big dance number, where they won't do and cover a landmark beach or where no, what I meant, I wait, what was MI's role in that movie? I just remembered. 
I don't even know. What I'm saying, maybe he's friends with Leah in real life, and I'm like, let's just bring him to the movie to push it forward. What I'm saying, I'm not saying that they should bring dancers as much. Well. I said they should have had backup dancers because we are used to the Indian people having so many, but I'm not saying they should have had so many dancers. I'm saying I'm they should, saying have, they should had have had it, people. and I'm saying they probably didn't have it because no, they should have had even if it's ten people. They did it. They did dance at the beach. There was nobody there. That's a lot of space to so you have that. backup dancers. Do you understand what I mean? Mm. And then with the fashion, and then another thing again, that girl I know had to be beautiful, and I feel like that movie, there was nothing. Uh, her friend was even more beautiful. Her friend, facially. Her, her friend be changing the wigs, be doing the makeup late. She, she was, was just, just on, on that wig. I'm like, uh, even the first thing when she did a good job, I'm like, in what world do me stand up from my bed to go and jog with full wig on? Not be weaving your take a jog. I'm like, maybe they just did it that way because Raj is Indian and you might see how it's weaving and not recognize that the next time she's wearing wig. That is one. Two, she was on the natural. That's what I say. This is what I say about wardrobe and costume and makeup. Like, if it's not epic movies that they need to draw on your face, and they don't take it serious. Like, you come with your makeup from home, or uh -huh. you come with your own. You need to stop doing that, June. Yes, they do. They your own defeat. This guy likes this. I'm not sleep for yesterday night. Maybe yawn. No. It's so telling. As supposed to work in relation to what we are saying right now, when you do that, it's so telling that that's how boring the movie actually was. And I do not disagree. And I'm right there with you. And then, and then I'll make one quick point, and which is the point that the love life was not felt. I felt nothing. I did not feel love between them. I, I did not. I had more chemis chemistry nothing. with me and my biscuit. In fact, with me and my cup of water. And those two people had. I can I can actually act a better love scene with only me, just me. Who of them make you not want to fall in love? Do you understand? Like you just saw at the beach, looked at yourself, yeah. say you want I'm to, going to marry her. The, oh. Girl, I beg tell me, how many boys we don't tell you that statement you actually did? I don't know. Is that, if, when we're young, let's say is that thing to bust our heads. You are going to be my wife. Right? Oh, but no, that please. Thing, I was, it's like, maybe you make, you make that statement, you're going to be my wife. Do I dust my slippers? Like, <laughs> what I'm I, saying I is, now take off. There was, there was nothing. Nothing. In fact, there was no make believe as to the love they were fighting for. Absolutely nothing. The there was fact no that they chemistry. Went... The chemistry was dead. My one is that you people not do like, script reading or any like when they were casting didn't they let the cast read script to each other to know like is there no. chemistry there or is there no chemistry there i'm like if raj was the selling point they would have brought raj and done readings with different actors and see the one that caught the chemistry what's the what's the what's the other lawyer's name uh, i like to i always like to use their character name in the movies girl you um, know me when i watch movie and i don't like that. Uh, Osa is not a character name. That's a name. That no, I know. I was going to call her. A character name was something, something, funny more, a bit something. And so what I'm trying to say is, she even brought the sass. She even brought better sass. Osa always knows how to bring sass. I feel Do you like understand? That's she... a selling point, and she's kind of getting typecast. Am I the only one saying it? I don't even know. Like she doesn't really lead, she doesn't take leading roles, though they don't give it to because her. Because she's know not likable. Yeah, she has a resting bitch face. face. No, you can say it. it's fine. A resting bitch face. That's why I told you, she's not likable. It's hard for people who are not like, it's not like she did something that you don't like about. It's like, girl, I don't just like your vibe. And I feel like even the producers, directors, they know, like, girl, it's us as lead. <laughs> It better be some you, protagonist, antagonist believe, lead at the same time. I can believe that that could be your sassy's real character in real life. Because other than that sassiness, when she comes in my t to my TV screen with something else, I just don't relate. Do you understand? Even when she's doing that, mommy, daddy, you know, she got the American in her and all mm. that. So I feel like the ghetto or the sassy, salty side of her is what actually sells. And 
again that tells that's telling to a good actor as to them not being able to kill different roles do you understand i mean yeah there are some actors that are unlikable but they still get rules look at an actor for that matter she's not a very very likable actress but she still gets rules because she gets the work done so osas i don't know maybe somebody she should try her she might shock us she, she might shock us any role you put high in mm. so at the end of the day we are able to you, you want to be able to differentiate the actor from who they are so when they come on the screen it's like once it's camera lights action what they you are buying what you are yeah you are buying what so osas you can't be buying in in, in dima or whatever her name is, i wasn't buying what she was selling and then again guess what they had good sponsors this is my point again i had to screenshot their sponsors they had good sponsors they had coca-cola yeah this, I, saw this, a lot of coke I think indomie is part of it isn't it no that's for more that's a company they didn't really i don't know what the company that sponsors the noodles but oh, there was a food are, company oh, 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 uh, jesus christ i'm trying to remember it's still indom is under them i'm trying to remember their name i think yeah. that's the one that sponsor is it usc no? i don't even know but i know there was a food company that was it's even sterling bank sterling bank they had coca-cola we know how rich coca-cola is they had coca-cola they had sterling bank they had my the point food is that people. if they have those sponsors they shouldn't be on a tight budget so it's not like that's what i mean yeah. they had klm they had klm as a sponsor so you want to tell wow. me that you could not drag out some few millions because the movie did not have too many casts so you want to tell me they didn't even use anything extravagant in that movie we were just Jonathan, you want to tell cars, me you literally the only that's what i said the only people that came correct when you see rmd you know that he's a rich man especially that time he came to the he, the dressing you will know that this one came with his clothes from who because no, ain't nobody be giving him that wardrobe with them dripping they don't want you to be this is what i keep saying when it comes to movies you need to make sure that whatever you say this is a rich man let him be dripping like a rich man don't say he's rich and they'll be coming with sleeper looking tacky you understand what i mean so then again that's it that's all i have to say like that movie let's just close the chapter it's, it's let's close. We, we could go on and on why we don't like the movie so for tea to pepper soup it was obviously a very hot hot cup of water on a hot day not very no, likable yeah. no milk no it's not the kind of water you want to drink on a hot day but like i'm thirsty let me drink so mm -hmm. yeah and like let me, just, let me just throw this out there i know no netflix representative is watching my channel but can, now they look the film themselves before now they buy them um, let's say some things because there are some we know netflix just keep pumping content in 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 but like some of the contents are not what it is know that the nigerian market is who has enough money to put it on that platform it's who they are buying they are selling to you know, we have a lot of nigerian movies that could be even i'm even waiting for epic movies even these regular movies that they are they're even more interesting like netflix should put movies no, no, it, so the problem is not netflix the problem will be the way nigeria do things and netflix nigeria obviously have nigerians in netflix nigeria so now who we'll get connection yeah, somebody that could go to that country yeah. and you see how the big big, the big big sponsor my point is like yes the big big sponsors they are cashing like oh so this this is and this sponsor your movie would like to buy it but get people to actually watch the movie i'll be like you know mm. joy who so you just be like oh because we have so many money in netflix we can buy everything give me your rubbish give me your rubbish i'll pay i'll pay i'll pay what put it there let people spoil their eyes with nonsense we, uh, you know, okay. any movie they put there we'll be watching and because there's, there's just few nigerian movies so when it hits everybody goes to you know want to see what they that i'm still seeing that namaste wala is number one in the top 10 number one in nigeria i'm like why this is this no let me tell you something people are what like we said the trailer was better than the actual movie people don't know that to know that you have to see for yourself Come to no. my video and see you, so you not going to spoil your eyes. Exactly. So that's what that's what and people will keep seeing it, and that's why people people will see it more. Because everybody wants to see what you're talking about, guys. It, it's not that. Like, you know, but they give them promotion. 
<laughs> so yeah <laughs> all right guys that's it for this video thank you so much for watching if you are still with us it's a long video so i hope you took several seats so give this video a like thank you and do consider subscribing to our channel lots of thanks from jenny from jules bye